Current temperatures outside, we are starting out into the 50s in most spots, upper 40s for some of the inland areas like in Reedsville, 49, 53 for Sylvania, also for Statesboro, 54, Savannah, Hilton Head checking in at 57, and Beaufort coming in at 53 degrees. Arctic air once again is coming southward out of Canada. Here we are in March, and it's kind of hard to believe we're seeing another blast of this Arctic air right through the heartland of the country. Minus 9, Minneapolis, Kansas City, minus 4, Louisville, 18. Some of this colder air will work into our area as we go throughout the daytime tomorrow. Take a look at today. Enjoy today. One more nice and warm day. Spring like temperature 76 and here comes the cold air by tomorrow. Look at this almost 30 degrees colder for tomorrow afternoon than what we'll see today. It's definitely going to feel a lot colder after the 70s the last couple of days. Also breezy north winds tomorrow, making things feel colder than that 48. Remaining below average throughout the remainder of the work week for Thursday or for Wednesday and Thursday in the 50s and into the 60s once we get into Friday. The cold front just back off to the west. Rain now being reported in Atlanta, stretching down all the way to southern parts of Mississippi. And you can see that line of showers continue slowly moving off toward the east. This is just one narrow band. It will not last too long once that rain moves to our area later this afternoon into the evening hours. And we'll clear things up uh, as we go into the late overnight as that Arctic air begins to move southward. Now, I was talking about the major winter storm from Kentucky. Now it's moving into West Virginia and Washington, expecting maybe over six inches of snow throughout the daytime today for the nation's capital. Now, outside later today, here's a look at that storm tracker model. Showers back off to the west. Let's see how everything's going to play out throughout much of the day. Fairly dry, but by four o'clock, you can see the inland areas. Showers developing, spreading to the coast once we get into five o'clock. So after work today, driving home, do expect to see some showers around all the way up through six o'clock. After seven, it moves off the coast once the cold front moves through and I do expect the clouds to maybe break up a little bit but fill back in when you wake up on Tuesday morning. Cloudy skies tomorrow only in the 40s with north winds and then watch this another round of rain rain likely on Wednesday and that'll stretch into Thursday as well. Storm tracker seven day forecast one more spring like day with temperatures in the 70s before really cooling off for Tuesday 48. There's the 50s for Wednesday and Thursday with rain likely and seeing lots of sunshine by the upcoming weekend and this cold air not lasting too long back into the 70s by Saturday.